I'm Angela. Aiden. Hello, everyone. My name is Thomas Boyle, and I play Aiden in Uneducated. I started voice acting about nine years ago, uh, auditioning for fan projects online with a, a cheap little PlayStation headset. Um, I think one night I was staying up late watching Full Metal Alchemist, and I thought to myself, that's what I should do. So then I started auditioning online and just picking up roles here and there. About that, I'm sorry. I should have said bye or something. Yeah, no, it's cool. I got you. <laughs> it's totally all right. My feelings weren't hurt or anything. Aiden matches up with me pretty darn close. Um, but I like to think that, you know, I treat my wife in the same way that Aiden treats Angela. Okay, anything you'd like me to make for dinner? Anything is fine. I like your cooking. And that I really make it a point to treat, you know, women in, in the same vein that Aiden treats other women. You know, as people. I am an idiot. You're ungrateful. It's not like I don't enjoy having sex with her, but that's not what I'm after. You're a chick. Swear to God, you're a chick. Stop saying sexist shit like that. You're definitely being a schoolgirl right now. Maybe she's the man and you're the woman. Go home, Kevin. Uh, encouragement goes so, 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 so much further than anger and frustration when you are in a relationship and you're trying to get over, you know, um, road bumps. You're strong. You've been walking on a rocky path for a long time, and you haven't faltered. I respect that you're going back to finish school. Most people our age wouldn't even bother. It's admirable. You're trying to do well for yourself by yourself. You're cool. My favorite character is Angela. Um, I'm a person who believes that it is never too late to make a change or focus on yourself for a while. Um, it's true, most people see themselves at Angela's age and say, I have what I have and I'll never get better, but Angela decided to keep moving forward and I think that's inspiring. I would say that there is something that I really like about the scene between Aiden and Angela at the art museum, where they're wearing um, like the sunglasses, you know, sweet shades. <laughs> uh, Angela, Angela finally opens up to Aiden about some of her personal life. And I feel that that's one out of many significant, significant turning points uh, for her. And I'm not sure she even realizes it at the time, which I think is super cool. Um, she opens up to Aiden, um, from my perspective, totally, you know, on the spot. And she hasn't had a lot of time to think about what she is or isn't going to say. She just says it. And I think that sort of stands as a testament to what Angela and Aiden are as a couple, even if they don't know it yet. Um, so that scene isn't super dramatic or anything, but I think it says a lot about the characters, especially Angela. God, I love you. Did you enjoy the project? Yes, yes, I enjoyed the project. Uh, Uneducated is a drama that is not afraid to take people with very real, you know, psychological uh, hangups and display their lives and relationships with honesty. Um, and I say honesty as opposed to ridiculous drama because that's what it is, in my opinion. Um, what I really think is special about Uneducated is that it isn't afraid to be happy. Um, it says you might have similar problems, but it's okay. You can still be happy as long as you don't give up right before the finish line. Um, that not every story has to be 
super, super sad. <laughs> Just to be sad. Um, is there sadness? Uh, there's definitely sadness. And how far that sadness goes, you'll have to find out. Thanks, everyone. Bye. I guess you win. <laughs>